Can you guys see the sky? It is orange. All the smoke is coming from the Bay Area. All of Napa Valley in those areas, there's a lot of smoke and it's coming everywhere, everywhere. And that's what it looks like this. It's been, it's one in the afternoon, 1 p.m. in the afternoon. And this is how the sky looks. Creepy. Look at the sun, it looks orange. Praise the Lord, everyone! Praise the Lord, it'll raise a sword. Manuel or Kibro are not here. I'm gonna record. I hate it when I record everything. How's the mac and cheese, Kenny? It's the best, Mom. How's the food, Jaden? Good. Story time, everyone! <laughs> when I was, uh, 15 years old, I had the privilege of going to Riverbank Christian Academy where you would do paces. Basically, I did high school all by myself. So when we were in high school, people would be like, praise the Lord or raise the sword of the Bible. Cool. At the Christian school. It's a Christian apostolic school. What are you talking about? The best of the best. I'm just thinking. Uh, what else? What other story can I tell? Right now, because uh, when I'm at home, I can't vlog because, as everybody knows, we live with we live with our parents. That's how that's how we can afford to build little by little. We haven't built in Mexico. We still haven't built anything at all. So sad. Everybody knows that as of now in California, you can only eat outdoors. But we're in the middle of August. It's super hot. And I'm guessing that in at nighttime, it's probably like you have to make a line or you have to be on a waiting list. So we've been eating inside, takeout, just at home, eating at home, just at home. That's why I was like, no, you know what? Today I'm just gonna we're gonna go out to eat. But it was not a good idea. It's too hot. Too hot. Even though we were in the shade, it's it's still hot. And we're here in California. I could only imagine how it is over there in Puerto Peñasco, Rocky Point. So, spend the day with us, you guys. Spend the day with us. We're going to go right now. We're going to the exciting Petco. Who wants to come with us? What's up? So, we came to Petco because Jose Manuel is... He's decided already that he's going to buy himself a bird. He's been wanting a bird for as back as I can remember like for many years today's the day people today's the day that he's gonna buy himself a bird I don't know it depends if they have a certain bird I want actually they're not gonna really have any birds because remember the last time they came here there was no animals and that was a different bird. look a skinny pig never seen these before they're you know weird They cry like the guinea pigs. Bird 
cage is actually more expensive than the actual bird. $85. This one's $29. Think about it, Jose Manuel. Having a bird is a lot of responsibility. You have to keep cleaning the cage all the time. And then where are you going to keep it? You can't keep it in the garage. It's going to die. I'm not going to be cleaning around your room. You guys are going to have to start cleaning your own room. Okay, Kenny? Okay. And if you guys get a bird, I'm definitely will ask. You need to buy the bird food, feed it, clean it, and I'm not going to do that. <laughs> no, I'm saying it right now, that's what I say. I heard that. 18 years old. Okay. Uh. A nine year old. outside so where are we going next we're going to um... okay bye tomorrow we're gonna come are they open tomorrow Jane and Kimmy
since Jose Manuel or Gibraltar are not here, I'm going to record. I hate it when I record everything. How's the mac and cheese, Kenny? It's the best, Mom. How's the food, Jaden? He doesn't know how to fly yet. The kids let him out so he could be out here a little bit. Petrie! Huh? Oh, wow. Let me see, put it next to him. Hi, Mom, move. Mom, move. Mom. Ready. Mom. Oh, what's that? The one. We need tweezers, so on. So on. For what? For so we can cut off the little metal thing. Can you tweeze? You got another present from your uh, Maricela and your uncle Adrian. Yeah. Hey, right, thank you. Money. Nice. <gasps> Anna, happy birthday. Andale. Blessings from Money. God. Ay, ay, ay. Penny. Penny. Oh, what the? <laughs> How cute. Oh, it's a game thing? Oh, it's cool. Read it. What does it say? Unlock the... What does it say, Kenny? Okay, unlock the power of today and conquer new levels of awesome. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> May God bless you with many more years. Love your deals. Is the door open? You like it? Oh, okay. I don't know what their sneaker You want to show your uncle in front? Okay. In estos momentos hay mucha gente que está siendo atribulada, aleluya, y preocupada. Pero nosotros, mire, estamos en este lugar. Vivo, lleno de salud lleno de energía Dios ha estado con nosotros se cumple la aleluya amen. señales por aquí señales por allá, aleluya pero la iglesia sigue adelante lugar, la patria celestial, a estar con el Señor por toda la eternidad así es que hoy voy a hablarles un poquito de la fe, vivirá Padre eterno, en esta hora yo vengo para presentarte este mensaje que has puesto en mi corazón levantarse para ser liberado para ser protegido Señor de todas estas mentiras que el diablo ha puesto en su mente, tú Señor vas a tratar con su vida en esta hora aquellos que me están escuchando en diferentes partes de México en diferentes partes del mundo aleluya, tú vas a tratar con alguien en esta tarde Señor, porque está Señor entrampado a, a, encarcelado aleluya, pero tú eres bueno Señor, y yo sé que tú le vas a ayudar a cualquiera esa persona por la cual me has puesto a predicar este mensaje, en el nombre de Jesucristo, Amén Day one of a regular blog no editing, no music no pictures and here we have my daughter Kenny peeling potatoes for the first time ever Mommy, First time cut, ever in her life? Mama, I cut my finger. How do you feel about peeling potatoes? We're brothers? We're brothers? <laughs> and I'm drinking my beet, orange. Mommy should do this. And I'm not screaming at my kids. What? Do, um,. You should do a show that 
Day one, not screaming at my kids. I never yell at you, Kenny. Yes, you do. Me? Mm-hmm. I never yell at you. I check my noise. Day one of crying from Sarita being gone. Day one of making mashed potatoes. This is the only thing my daughter will eat, potatoes. Mom, I can't get this off, Mom. I got it. Hey, what's this? Beets, orange, and carrots. Mom, what's wrong with this potato, Mom? Mom. I, they put more... Oh, that's... Just... Princess getting mad because <laughs> Leave her alone, pobrecita ya está viejita la princess. No one you don't want nobody touching candy princess, hmm? Like Charlie in the morning, everybody ignores him. <laughs> so, what do you think, Cosmo? You take the, the challenge? No. Mira mi esposo que trabajador que guapo se mira. I am totally amazed. It's August 9th, 1.30 p.m. The ground is burning hot. And I'm really thankful to God that my husband has not non-stop worked on the car. He never gave up. So happy. Our car broke down. ¿Cuándo se descompuso el carro, Kibron? De esta semana. On, what, on Tuesday, the car just stopped in the middle of the road. We had to push it. Thank God it was nearby the house. But we've been without a car. We've been without no car for all this week. It's Sunday. And just when we're about to give up, we kept working on the car. Ya le estamos volviendo a... El quibro ya le está poniendo el gas. A ver si funciona. Tuvimos que vaciar todo el tanque de gas. Porque estaba bien pesado. Lo habíamos llenado. Y ahora es for the moment of truth to see if it turns on. Thank you, Jesus. It turned on. Yes, thank you, Lord. Oh, my God. Yeah, Katie, I don't know how it is. Well, what? What? Katie, did you shrink? There's no way because Katie's five, it says he's 5'9. Let's see. We'll stand straight. Okay. 
Yeah. Kate was like five nine and a half, and Kate Jen's five ten. Mm. And what about you? Two and a quarter. That's not a cent. I was like, I like six. Three.